two, one, go! Here we go during the 15 second autonomous period of qualification match number 35. B-Squad lining up, and look at that. The red boiler landing quite a few fuel particles into the high-efficiency goal. Remember, that's one point for each KPA gained during the autonomous period. 78 to 75, slim lead for the Red Alliance, but a lead nonetheless. Lakota Robotics, Team 1038 on the far side of the field, just vacuuming up every single fuel particle that they can possibly find. Red Alliance now being signaled by the referees for coming in contact with robots in the retrieval zone of the Blue Alliance. That's a tech foul. Less than a minute and a half left to go, still a lot of time, 165 to 118. Your Blue Alliance leading. Great gameplay being done by both alliances. Two rotors spinning. And now, Team 4028 of the Red Alliance. That's the Beak Squad. They are spinning up their turret. Lining up the shot. And a few test shots, and there they go. Building up that pressure, the other side of the, the field, we're gonna find the Blue Alliance doing the same, courtesy of Team 1038. 45 seconds left in the match. 166 to 125, KPA being built up on both sides of the field via the Beak Squad and Lakota Robotics. Eight KPA for red, three KPA for blue, as we head towards the end game period. Robots are now preparing for takeoff as the ropes on the side of the airship are signaling, hey, we're almost ready to go. Blue Alliance getting that third rotor spinning. As Team 2010, the Lightning Bots, climb aboard the airship. Less than 10 seconds left to go. Red Alliance in the lead. Blue Alliance looking to get their robot. Hanging, Team 3173 nearly makes it. But the clock hits zero. Quick turnaround on that match. We have your scores ready. Airships taking flight above the clouds and through the finish line. Chasing the Red Alliance is the Blue Alliance. Red 241, Blue 2-0.